We're here to show you how easy it's going to be to use our new um, UH24 UNV unit heater bracket on the Modine hot dog unit heaters. Um, this fits out of the box anywhere from 30,000 up to 75,000 BTUs. The L brackets come with the Modine hot dog heaters. Um, so once they're mounted on the heater, which have to be done when you take it out of the box, you simply put the bracket on top, line up the center holes, and these bolts come with the unit. These bolts have rubber grommets on them, so we put rubber grommets um, on the top side, and we put them in each one of these holes, drops right in there, and then we have rubber washers that come with the locking nylon nuts so the rubber washer of course goes up against the metal like that so then you just grab a 9 16th box end open end wrench we got a ratcheted wrench here um, stick this on here basically just tighten these up with wrenches or a drill if you're set up, which is real nice. <clears throat> and once they're on there nice and snug, the next thing you want to do is put our, put our bolt in, which is a half inch bolt by three quarter inch head with a serrated end on it. This is for locking the upper bracket to the lower bracket when it's screwed together. But with Modine, we use the center hole. There's two holes with the Modine, we use the center hole on this. We screw this bolt in here about halfway, it's the perfect amount, roughly about that far, and we're all set on the heater. So then once that's done, we grab the upper bracket and we mount that to the ceiling. The upper bracket, these holes are spaced 16 on center or 24 on center and they could be shifted a little bit one way or the other. So it's pretty flexible with the holes that are punched into the top of this. Of course, it's got this nice little lip, nice little groove. So that's meant to um, go over top of the head, but this is mounted up to the ceiling with our two and a half inch by three eighths lag bolts and screwed up on whichever studs or joists or rafters, whatever you find to mount it to in the ceiling. Um, pretty easy to find a spot to mount it. Um, once the ceiling bracket is mounted to the ceiling, of course all you got to do is pick the heater up, either with two guys, one guy can do it, um, or a lift, but that just goes and slides over top of that bolt head. Once that slid over top, it's not going to come loose, it's supported, and then all that's left to do is tighten our bolt down using a three-quarter inch wrench. Um, ratcheted end works best, uh, box end works fine, um, but this gets, gets tightened down nice and tight. At whatever angle you want to do it, it can go at this angle or any angle you desire to put the heater at. But once you find the proper angle, you're gonna to wanna to really lock this in nice and firm here. Once that's locked in nice and firm, there's enough surface space here which holds that thing nice and level, nice and solid once it's up there. Um, we do ship along with it these L brackets here. These are meant to go on the side of the heater, um, both sides, and then you can level this off to the ceiling and fine tune it with leveling. Um, and stabilize it out at the ends of the unit if you care to do so. When our Modine unit heaters get over 100,000, get up uh, over 75,000 BTUs, and that's our hot dog, has 100,000 and 125,000 BTU unit, they move to a bigger chassis on that, which means the UH24 UNV will not work the way it comes out of the box as it does for the 75 and smaller. So what we've designed is um, the same type of a deal, but we make a couple brackets called the M angle brackets. And what they do is they simply bolt into this 
UH24 UNV, just like this, bolts are provided. And then the holes in this line up on the top of the 100,000 BTU hot dog and the 125,000 BTU hot dog heater. So when you're hanging 100 and 125 hot dog, you need to buy the UH24 UNV and you also need to add these angle brackets with it. All the hardware to mount these are provided in the box, uh, so it's all you know for anything necessary to mount it with. Um, but therefore, you can hang the UH24 UNV hot dog heater from 30,000 up to 125. Just remember that the 100, 125 requires the M angle, which is where their chassis gets bigger. Um, and then, of course, you go right back to using the center hole centers it out very nicely on the heater because Modine's holes are centered on the top of their heater. And then of course the ceiling bracket uh, can go on here so you can mount that 100 and 125 up to the ceiling or you can use our wall bracket to with this bracket and also hang it. So if you were going to hang a 100 or 125 unit off the wall, you're going to need three items. You're going to need our UH24 UNV. You're going to need our wall bracket, which is our UHWB36. And you're also going to need these M angles to get the 100 and the 125 to adapt to our UH24 UNV. I'm here to demonstrate how our wall bracket for unit heaters works. It's the UHWB36, means it's 36 inches away from the wall, and it's our unit heater wall bracket, so it's UHWB. That mounts to the wall, you find a stud or wood behind it, and you firmly lag or anchor this to the wall very, very firmly. We ship uh, lag bolts with it thinking you're going to mount it into wood, but you can use anchor bolts and mount it into concrete or however it works to mount it to the wall. But these go through here. They're like five and a half inch lag bolts, so there's plenty of it going into the wood. And then we have two bolt holes on the top where the majority of the weight hangs um, with reinforcement on the top of each one of them. Once this is anchored to the wall and you're satisfied with it there, the next thing you need to do is you need to put our angled support back to the wall here this is this bolts to there and this is designed to be angled out at 16 inches off of off of here so you can catch an, a 16 inch stud over here or you're going to have to put some backing or wood there to make sure that this is anchored on there nice and firm and of course this just bolts bolts through here like this with the hardware that we provide so that's the way that works. Once this is mounted to the wall, nice and firm, um, we use our ceiling bracket out of our UH24 UNV is the best uh, ceiling bracket. We have others, but the UH24 UNV is the best one to use when you use the wall bracket. And this is the ceiling bracket. And what this does is it bolts, bolts right to this. Okay, so it's sitting here like this. This bolts right to that with the bolt holes that come down through here. And this can be bolted out here as far out as this, or you can shift it back a few more inches or shift it back even a few more inches, depending on the size and the model of the unit you're trying to hang and the angle you're trying to hang it at. So you've got some options on how far that is actually away from the wall at the center point. So, you know, once that's on there, you hang the heater just like you normally would going to the ceiling and uh, you're hanging off the wall. It becomes very nice and solid, um, very sturdy.